Hey guys, it's Brian and Chase with the Midnight Mechanic. Today we're going to show you how to replace the thermostat on a Jeep Cherokee XJ like this 1999 Jeep Cherokee. Now these 4 liter engines are notorious for blowing head gaskets when they overheat, so keeping them at the optimal temperature is perfect for making them last forever. Now this is Chase's Jeep, so we're going to go ahead and let him do it while I just sit back and watch. Yeah, we're gonna make sure that we put a jug underneath this so that we don't have any coolant going flying into the car. We have nothing to clean it up with. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna unplug this coolant temperature sensor right here. And we're gonna get the bolt here and bolt down here. Alright, so now that I got these bolts out, we can just pop it right off. Ugh. Just like that. Alright, so what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to jiggle the thermostat right here and pull it out. And then we're going to want to scrape off the gasket right here as well as right here so we can put our new gasket on. your hand. We're good. Alright, so what we're going to want to do here is we're going to want to put this thermostat, this new one, in here so it lines up with these ridges. Just like that. And then we're going to take the thermostat. We're going to line it up. Just like this. And then we're going to start feeding these bolts through it to hold it in place. So that it's easier to put onto here, secure it at that thermostat. In. Right, here we go. All right, now that we have these bolts hand threaded in here, we're gonna get this electric ratchet, and we're just gonna. Pop them in. All right, last up, don't forget to plug in your coolant temperature sensor. Now we're just gonna fill it back up with coolant. All right, we're gonna start filling it back up with coolant with this fancy contraption here. And then we're gonna start it up and we're gonna bleed all the rest of the air out of the system. All right, now it's all fixed up. We have this new uh, thermostat on here, with the new thermostat on. Um, gasket and everything now it's no longer leaking coolant out of the housing and it's also holding it at the right temperature it's supposed to be at so now that this is done watch our next video where we replace the rear oxygen sensor in this so we got one more coming up in our series here chase will also be doing that one but until then don't forget to follow us on instagram and facebook at the midnight mech tiktok at the midnight mechanic we'll see you guys next time